Well, this is a new beginning for a seven-year-old Lakewood girl whose left hand was amputated when she was a baby. Yeah, she now has a new custom-built robo hand made from a 3D printer. CBS 2's Christina Lazar was there as she tried it out for the first time. Seven-year-old Faith Lennox makes using a 3D printed hand look as easy as riding a bike. The first grader's favorite part of her new left hand. I like the colors. She chose them, pink, purple, and blue. Because it's the color of the ocean. Faith was born with a rare condition called compartment syndrome. During her mother's labor, the circulation to Faith's forearm was cut off, damaging the skin, muscle, and bone. Initially, doctors tried to save it. She was about six months old and the bones broke in the forearm because the tissues down to the bones had died. Amputation was the only option. Faith's mom, Nicole, agreed. We just always had the impression that it's just an arm, it's just a hand, everything else, she's perfectly healthy. Faith tried various prosthetic hands over the years, but they were either too stiff or too bulky. And then her mom found the engineers at Build It Workspace in Los Alamitos, home to a 3D printer. We've never tried it on a, as a prosthetic before, and so this was part of the excitement of it all. Here's how it works. The computer talks to the 3D printer, which then builds the hand layer by layer. The whole process takes about 24 hours, and at the end of that, you have a working hand. The cost to build a hand in the 3D printer, about $50, compared to the traditional prosthetics that cost thousands. That enables kids like Faith to get new prosthetics more often as they grow. Faith's next order of business after she gets off her bike to get back to school. I want to show my friends my hand. In Los Alamitos, Christine Lazar, CBS 2 News.